and I'm getting heat rash. Oh, get it off me, get it off me, get it off. Oh. It still does look like the picture. It's got this lovely, I mean, if you want underboob for your wedding day, then Hans, this is the one for you. Hello, honeys. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're just joining me now, then this is so exciting. We are kicking off the wedding series. If you're new here, my name's Imogen. Hit that subscribe button, join the family of Hans. Give this video a massive like button already before you've even watched it, because I promise you it's gonna be a good video. And let's get in with trying wish wedding dresses on. I'm so excited. So I made a big order on Wish. I ordered five, actually I ordered six. <laughs> I ordered the same dress twice, I was that excited. But if you are new here, you won't know, but I'm not just trying wedding dresses on for fun. I am trying them on for fun, but I'm also trying them on because I'm getting married this year. And I kicked that off with an announcement with my partner. I will leave a link here or this side. Don't know which side it is, maybe this side. But I will leave a link to the Q and A where we reveal where we're gonna get married and when we're getting married. So really exciting. We should probably kick start with the first outfit. I don't know what these are gonna look like in real life. They're still in their wrapping, so let's do it. Here she goes, the first outfit. I don't even know which one this is. Oh, 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 oh. We've got a little halter neck number. Oh my goodness, I'm actually so buzzing to have started with this one. How cute is this? So it's got this like lace detail going all the way down. This is very boho. Like there are so many wedding dresses that you can choose from. You can be a Disney princess. You can be a little bit sexy. You can be a princess and sexy. You can be boho chic. You can be whatever you want. Like that gypsy bride where it's like really soft and subtle little shell necklace, you know? But I don't know what kind of wedding dress I'm gonna get yet. I really don't. And I'm gonna film those videos with you. So when I go to try wedding dresses on, you're gonna be coming with me. So make sure you stay tuned for those. But today, we're trying on these little numbers these little baddies so the floral detail on it is actually really cute like i don't think it's this is obviously going to be a wedding dress for me but i'm actually thinking this might be a maxi dress if it's not see-through that i actually like to wear it's really cute so i don't know whether i think this is long enough and you have to tie it up at the back so you like feed it through wish me luck with that one so this one was actually 14 pounds, which I think is amazing. So hopefully it looks as nice as it does on the model as it does on me. I mean, on the photo on the website, it looks a little bit better quality. It really does. It looks more structured like a wedding dress. However, I'm actually not really shocked at this one because it doesn't actually look that different. Like I thought it was gonna come and be really, really fake and looking bad, but it actually looks nice. So fingers crossed it looks nice on me. So Hans, this is the dress. Dress number one. So, as you can see, I tried to do the detailing on the back of myself, but these puppies, by the way, let's just not talk about them because, you know, time of the month and all that, I actually really think this dress is really pretty. Flare at the back. Oh, it actually does. Oh, I feel like this is like an evening wedding dress, though. I don't feel like this is very wedding wedding. I feel like this is more like I'm on the beach, I've just got married, and I'm going to be chilling in white because I don't want anyone to forget that I'm married. But other than that... I think it's quite cute. It's quite tight here in a weird way, but the back is pretty, isn't it? Ooh! So I am actually impressed. The way it curves to your body and like fits you, I'm actually shocked because I didn't think that it would be this nice. But it's obviously see-through a bit. I think you can see quite a bit, but I'm not wearing any underwear because I feel like on your wedding day, do you wear underwear? Like you want every curve to be seen. You don't want little lines, do you? So. This is actually quite cute. The back is really pretty as well. I mean, it's not my wedding dress, but still nice. <laughs> I'm going to keep it. Next one, number two. Oh, this feels more wedding dress materially. Is there something in the center of this? No. Ooh. Feels more satiny, you know, like a bit more structured. Okay. Oh my goodness. We've got some boob pads. Thank you very much for the breast pads, Hans. Oh, oh my God, I didn't think these would be as cute as they are. Like, wow. So obviously full length, and this is more of an ivory color than a cream. Is ivory really white? I'm really bad at describing things, just ignore me. Cute, very nice little back detail there. We've got the lace running all the way down. Oh, this is so much fun to get to try wedding dresses on with all of you, because it's like, obviously these aren't gonna be the wedding dresses that I, well actually, you never know. Maybe I do choose one of these dresses to wear. Oh. So this one was nine pounds. However, oh, is that? Oh my goodness. I hope you can see that. That is literally like black all over it. Do you think someone sent this back? I'm so dubious to try it on now because of the breast pads. I'm worried. 
Anyway, on the photo, this one was nine pounds, but on the photo it does look a lot thicker at the bottom. Like it's a lot thinner. It is a lot thinner. Borderline see-through, but it's fine. We're gonna, oh, it's actually, yeah. But we're gonna make it work. We are gonna make it work. I guess if you wanted to, you could just get things lined, like with a big puffer skirt underneath, you know, just to give it that big wedding feel kind of thing. Anyway, let's go and try this one on. And this, my little hun buns, is number two. I mean, this is my least favourite so far. I know I've only tried on two, but I don't know. I feel like this is like a curtain material. Like it's cut to one length, if you know what I mean. It's not really, it's not really me, is it? I don't know, is it? I don't know, I'm dancing in my wedding dress. I need to be comfy in my wedding dress. I'll be wearing comfy shoes. Like when I see girls getting Louboutins, Jimmy Choo's for wedding day, I'm like, wow, they look so beautiful. However, your baby girl has got to be comfy. No one's gonna be seeing my feet. I've got to find some comfortable shoes that I can dance with my baby prince all night long, all night, all night. Oh, no, not feeling it at all. It's, no. Like, you know the cups, they do nothing. Like, what are they doing for the mummies? Like, actually, I need like a cup like that. Do you know what I mean? Like, whoop, that's better. Cute, but no, not this dress. Like, the way it cuts you here just isn't attractive in the slightest. I don't like it. And these make you look like quite broad, I feel like. Whew. Oh, she's got muscle. No, stop, just ignore me. <laughs> I'm so annoying, but I don't like this one, Hans. This one isn't my favorite, but you let me know which one's your favorite. I feel like it would have been nice because the satin's quite cute. You might all think it looks nice on me. You probably don't. But anyway, let's go on to the next one. Yay. Right, number three actually came out of its package last night because it only came in the packaging. But look, I mean, so this one was 14 pounds. However, the material is that material that can make a lot of people cringe, like it's making me cringe. What is that? It's like that, uh, feels like barbed wire, but also like a net. This one is like, no, no, no. On the photo, it looks glittery, sparkly, diamante-ish, very luxury and very expensive. Although, I'm not stupid, like I know ordering things from Wish, like this one has one star. You know, it's a one star out of a five star rating, so I should have probably looked at that. But it's funny. It's all funny. However, the dress online looks so luxurious that it could never be £14. Like, it just couldn't, unless Primark was selling it. We love Primark. But this is like, I mean, it's puffy. Do you know what, though? In the actual light, it looks a lot nicer. Like, under these lights, it does actually look quite pretty, doesn't it? And, like, sparkly. Up close, <laughs> not so nice promise you that one. Anyway, let's try this one on anyway, shall we? That is see-through, isn't it? We're gonna see nips, we're gonna see the lot. Good luck to pups getting married to me. I'm gonna be all out on the wedding day. <laughs> oh, rude. <laughs> all right, all right. That material, can you see anything? That material is killing my vibe puns. Although one thing I do like about this, right? Let me tell you, comfort is key for your baby girl. And I just slip this one on because it's literally just a little elasticated. Look elasticated. I feel like a fairy godmother. And what may I grant your wishes? I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, no, just stop. Anyway, how cute is this? I mean, it's not the one for me. I feel frumpy. I don't feel sexy. I don't feel like I'm a bride. I feel like, I don't know. It's not for me, Huns, at all. No, 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 no. I know I'm not, but I feel like, a, I don't know, a big white roll of marshmallow and I don't know. I'm sorry if you can see anything, but I just feel like this is really frumpy. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, the way it cuts, Hans, I've got to get it off. This material as well, it's cringing me out. I'm getting all goosebumps. And I'm getting heat rash. Oh, get it off me, get it off me, get it off. Oh. Number four. Ba -dum -bum. We're working our way through these. Working my way back to you, babe. I'm only love inside. I'm in working. I always think I'm Christina Aguilera when I sing like that, but I'm not. Oh, oh, oh my, oh my goodness. I've chosen some pretty ones. I feel like for these videos, you're meant to like, like test ones that you think are gonna be really bad. But I actually just went with like, oh my God, this is so pretty. How pretty? Huns, that is so cute. I love the sleeves. I feel like a gypsy princess, you know, the boho-y kind of vibe. Anyway, it's really nice. This one feels thicker than the other ones, and I like the flower detailing on the lace. 
Ooh. When I actually go to try wedding dresses on, I'm gonna get so excited, aren't I? Apparently you cry a lot, which doesn't help me because I cry 24 seven anyway. So I'm just gonna be brilliant. This one was 12 pounds and I actually think it looks really like the picture. Like I actually do, looking at the picture now. It doesn't look as lined, but it still does look like the picture. It's got this lovely little ribbon detail band around this waist to suck us in, hoist us in. Love our little lives. I love the whole fact that the back is, ah, yes it is, it's lace. So should I not wear a bra with this one? But what if we see? Oh, we're all best friends here, it's fine. We're all sharing, caring humans, you know? We're best friends. Anyway, I'm so excited to try this one on. Because I feel like it's going to be really pretty. It's got like, yeah. Oh, because it's got like a little slit. Okay, let's try this one on. Yay! Okay, angels, this was the one I was the most excited about trying on. I'm sad because it is see-through, but it doesn't matter. But I actually really like it. Like, I actually like this dress. I think it's so pretty. Look at the back. And like, the arms are so like princessy and just fairy-like. I think this is so cute. What do you think? I know that I think my family would like this one. It is see-through, but the thing is if I wore a bra, then you'd see it out the back, and I feel like I wanted to show you the back detail. I mean, I wish I got it in an extra small. Whoa, there. Can I hide it with my hair? Or is my hair not long enough? I'm not a mermaid. I want my hair to be long enough so I feel like a mermaid. I'm so annoying. Stop. Anyway, how pretty is this? Like, the sleeves are so nice. I just think it's so cute. If it was just a bit tighter, I mean, I would've got christened in this. Like, I think this is so pretty. I like this whole style, this vibe of like being pretty for your wedding day. I don't feel like I wanna go down the sexy route. I'm not sure, I'm not sure. I feel like once I try wedding dresses on, then I'll just know. Do you ever know? But it is actually so pretty, isn't it? Like, I really like this look on me. I think it's really like, yeah, like natural and pretty and just floaty and cute. I feel like this is very much beach wedding, don't you think? This is beach wedding, like, I'm on the beach, my feet are in the sand, and I'm just walking along, just being cute, holding my husband's hand. <gasps> that was a rhyme. Sometimes I rhyme, and I don't actually mean to. But what do you think of this one? I like this detailing. I feel like it sucks you in and just makes it look pretty. Oh, this one's cute. This is my favourite so far, I think. Also, please let me let me know if you like videos like this because I really want to do more videos like this. I love just sitting down showing you the item, then getting up and trying it on with my best friends. Like that just really excites me. So let me know if you like me doing any of these videos. I will test anything you throw at me. You tell me a makeup to test, you tell me some clothes to try on, whatever. I'll come for it. Love life. Go number five. Okay, so this one was the one that I saw and I was like, oh my goodness, like I need to try that on so badly. So that was my most excited one to try on. It has actually got a little bit of a fishtail at the bottom, but it is no way near as structured as what it looks like on the photo. Like on the photo, they look like real wedding dresses. Feeling them now, they look like maxi dresses, if you know what I mean, but really pretty maxi dresses, but just not the same. But, oh, we've got a bit sexy with this one. We've got the lace there. I know what my fiance is like, and if I look really sexy, he loves me looking like hot and stuff, obviously, but he's not really about that. Like, he doesn't look at me as if, like, you've got to be sexy. Like, he loves it when I don't have any makeup on and I'm, you know, just me chilling. I guess everyone likes that, though, don't they? Like, when someone's just natural in their own natural sort of state. But I know if I turn up to the wedding in this, I don't know whether he'd be up for it. I don't know. We've got the little breast bit. There's no breast pads on this one, but the back's really pretty. Oh my God, I'm so excited. This one was 14 pounds and I'm so excited to try this one. Imagine you found a wedding dress for 14 pounds. Like how buzzing would you be? Cause they are expensive. Like, do you know what? Since starting to plan the wedding, wow, 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 wow. It's a license to print money. They just want to take your money, your dollar dollar. Like apparently the average wedding price for the UK is the £35,000. £35,000 for one day. And you don't even get married at like nine o'clock in the morning. You get married like later on in the day. It's just not even a day. It's a half a day. Anyway, I'm excited. Just my bank balance isn't. <gasps> oh, I love doing that video. That was so much fun. Huns, oh my goodness, she be tight. She be tight. Let me tell you, can I breathe? No. Is my boob out? Yes. Does my bum look quite nice? I think so, oh my goodness. If only these were adjustable, I feel like my boob could fit in, but one is higher than the other, like, I can't get my boobs in. And my boobs aren't big, but, oh no, it's a really pretty dress though. Like, it's actually got like a little cute bit at the bottom, I think. If I could fit it, I just, I just don't know. Like, can you see? Oh, I nearly fell over then. I just feel like, mm, no. Is it cute? It, it is cute, if you fit it. 
if you actually fit it. But the thing is, they're not adjustable. So like my boob is just like chilling. I mean, if you want under boob for your wedding day, then Hans, this is the one for you. Not for me, not for me. A really nice, pretty dress though. Like if you actually look at it, it is actually quite a nice dress at like the detailing. It's just too tight and your baby girl wishes these were adjustable because one boob's like down here, one's just chilling up here. I'll just walk around like that the whole day. Hi. Thank you, thank you, yeah, yeah, it's such a lovely wedding, thank you. You're right, yeah. Just chilling in front of my grandma. Probably not. Okay. <laughs> that is it. Oh god, let me know which one you like the best. So that is the end of trying wish wedding dresses on. I really hope you liked this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Smash that subscribe button, I'd be so grateful. Don't smash it, don't break it, just love it forever. But hopefully you can join my family of Huns because I've got so much more content coming your way. I upload every Tuesday, every Saturday, and every Sunday. Three videos a week for my baby Huns. And yeah, I've got loads more wedding content coming your way. Let me know what wedding videos you want to see down below. If there's any wedding videos you want to see, whether it's bridal makeup, whether it's obviously you're gonna see me trying on wedding dresses, my hen do you're gonna get to see. So I'm gonna be sharing as much as I can with you. And I'm so excited for you to see every part of this journey with me. I love you all so much and until next time, I'm gonna love you and I'm gonna leave you. I'm so annoying. I love you, bye.